how about a drink? Well, meet me over on the Carnival Jubilee to explore all of the bars on this incredible ship. Carnival Jubilee will offer 15 bar or lounge areas where you can find premium drinks and beverages with two of these venues being brand new and only offered exclusively on Jubilee. Stick around until the end of the video for a visit to these two new areas debuting on Jubilee. Now, before we belly up to the bar, do me a favor. Complete four things. They're quick, super easy, and uber helpful. Number one, smash down on that subscribe button. Number two, give this video a like. Number three, tap on that notification bell. And finally, after the video, go to the comments and let me know which one of these bars do you like the most? What's your favorite? Okay, let's get this party started. Grand Central is Carnival Jubilee's massive atrium. This beautiful area is where we find the Grand View Bar. Here, you will have a stunning view of the action, including a 14-foot LED screen, floor-to-ceiling windows, and 1,400 color-changing lights as you sip on great drinks with a view. Also in Grand Central is the Piano Bar 88. Here, you will find a mellow and relaxed atmosphere that is a great place to enjoy different spirits, while you sing along with your fellow cruisers to fun and ever popular tunes. Let's go to the Lido. The Lido deck is probably the most recognizable deck aboard most cruise ships. Here is where sun meets fun. The Lido deck brings you to the Red Frog Tiki Bar. This is an elevated classic of the poolside rum bar. This bar has two decks of South Pacific atmosphere with an ideal mix of tantalizing drinks and a laid back atmosphere and live music. Also located on the Lido deck is the Tides Pool Bar. This is Lido aft or the rear of the ship. This is an outdoor bar with a bit of a quieter Lido experience, if that's possible. Here you can experience the outdoor vibes while fun tropical drinks are being poured and you can do some people watching to go with it as well. Now we're headed to the Summer Landing Zone. Summer Landing is a vibrant and lively part of the ship bathed in the warm glow of the sun. Carnival calls this the greatest chill spot at sea. Here we find our first bar, the Watering Hole. This is a poolside bar that's been built for aficionados of backyard style relaxation. The Watering Hole is a tropical oasis that exudes a laid back beach vibe. Bartenders whip up fruity cocktails with flair. And guests can sip their drinks while lounging in hammocks or on bar stools overlooking the pool. The Heroes Tribute Lounge is a welcoming space with a patriotic touch. A large American flag decorates one wall and there are photos of heroes from various walks of life. The atmosphere is cozy with comfortable leather chairs and dim lights, making it a perfect spot for relaxation. Bartenders mix specialty cocktails with precision and guests can enjoy live music or simply unwind while gazing at the sea. This is a wonderful spot aboard Carnival ships that honors our military heroes. Now we're headed to our next location, Guy's Pig and Anchor Brew House. This is a rustic and lively bar inspired by the flavors of the South. The aroma of smoked barbecue fills the air as guests enjoy a selection of beers brewed right on the ship. This exclusive line is called Parch Pig Craft Brews. There's a smoked porter, a farmhouse ale, a hoppy IP, and a toasted amber, all brewed just feet from your table. We're headed over to the Havana Bar, where we are transported to classic antebellum Cuba. Here, you can take in great ocean views as you try something that is authentically Cuban, such as a Cubano, which is a Cuban coffee. Or you can try a handcrafted Cuban cocktail, such as things like daiquiris, mojitos, and more. And this spot definitely does not cool down at night. 
When the sun goes down, the music and dancing keep things hot well into the night. We're now headed to the Alchemy Bar. This is a unique vintage themed cocktail pharmacy. Here you can try something new and uncover enticing combinations that include select spirits, fresh juices, infused syrups and spices, and other tantalizing secrets. These are performed right before your very eyes by true mix masters, the bartenders. Choose a remedy from the menu or let them prescribe you a custom elixir just for you with or without alcohol. Winning big in the casino is always big fun, and your next stop is celebrating with a top shelf drink. Located right off the casino floor, the casino bar serves up your favorite cocktails, beer as well as wine. This makes the casino the perfect stop to celebrate with family, friends, and maybe win it big. Now we're headed to the Serenity Adults Only Retreat Area. Here you'll find yourself in an area of complete peace, surrounded by sea breezes and, of course, the Serenity Bar. At this bar, you can find some of your favorite cocktails and drinks as you relax, take in the beautiful sea breezes, and enjoy Serenity. Now we are moving on to one of the two new zones, especially aboard the Carnival Jubilee. And we're talking about the shores. This is the spot where the water meets the land. And the inspiration for this zone is beaches and boardwalks. Here on the shores, we can find such things as Coastal Slice. This is the hot spot that you can get fresh pizza. But we are going to take a look at the Marina Bar. This is an indoor outdoor spot where drinks are only part of the refreshment story. There's also some great lounging to do as well. Check out this beautiful new area that's hip and happening and enjoy some of your favorite drinks and cocktails as you take in the area where the water meets the land. Now we have come to the second and final new zone that we're going to talk about today when it comes to bars and that is Currents. Currents is the zone of the world that exists underneath the water. Think of mermaids sea monsters, and even sunken cities. Currents is a beautiful area where you can enjoy new bars, new dining zones, as well as live music. Here you will find six huge LED windows that help to transport you to the underwater world as they, and of course the wave-shaped LED ceiling, give you views of immersive digital undersea environments. Now it's time to head over to Dr. Inks PhD. Get it? D R I N K S PhD. Let me tell you all about this. We're talking about an octopus that mixes drinks. Uh, yeah, I know. This octopus is called Dr. Inks PhD, and she is considered the cleverest of sea creatures. It says here that the drinks that she creates aren't just tasty, but they're truly unique. You can have jellyfish cocktails layered shots, and even more. Garnishes on the drinks have things such as boba pearls and sea foam. And there's not just drinks here, there's also live musical entertainment nearby. Next, we're headed to the Golden Mermaid. All right, let me tell you the story. Far below the waves, they met a mermaid who, swim th who swims the depths of the ocean to find the long lost treasure of ancient civilizations. And it wasn't just any mermaid, it was a golden mermaid. Here, the mixological treasures they've uncovered, cocktail recipes that are inspired by precious metals and gemstones. The drinks are said to be served in exquisite glassware. And then there are garnishes such as edible glitter, which will remind you of sunlight streaming through the waves from up above. The Carnival Jubilee bars and lounges, they look like they will be so much fun. It looks like a lot of fun, and we have some wonderful, unique offerings to look forward to. Of course, there can be changes, and I will keep you posted on any that are going to change or anything that we might have missed. If you haven't already, make sure to check out the video that I did on the Carnival Jubilee restaurants. 
So thank you so much, everyone, for joining us. Don't forget, leave me in the comments which one of these are you looking forward to the most. Thanks for joining us, and we'll catch you at the next adventure.